all right first and foremost i would like to give all praise and glory unto yahweh bahashem yahweh shah bahashem rakadash double honors unto the apostles and elders of gms who rule well teach well being great example to us younger brothers and peace and blessing salutation the hopeful luck out there pushing his word and truth and in sincerity across the four winds in the name of yahweh bahashem yahweh shah pushing to get up out of here Shout out to the hopeful like the believers, the listeners whom have came back to the obedience of the scriptures through faith in you. How about you? How shot? What I want to get into today, all right, this morning, all right, with the morning exhortation, is going into to pretty much, you know, where will we go? All right, where will we go? When I say that, to say this, <clears throat> we're coming into the straight gate. You know, we're coming to some very difficult times, you know, as believers. And it's going to be based on what we believe, you know, but it's already written in the script, all right, that we will go through particular things, you know, that we will have to go, I just could say, confirming the souls of the saints that through much tribulation that we we'll enter into the kingdom of heaven, you see, and we come to a time of much, all right, tribulation based on what we believe. There's a suffering that comes with believing in Yahweh Shah. There's a suffering before the glory. You know? But the thing about it, you know, we're pretty much exalted to go through those things because Yahweh Bashim Al Shah promised to be a guide unto us. You know? Those that keep his commandments and precepts through faith in Yahweh Shah. All right? So I just want to bring this account out real quick. I said real quick video. Um, as Yahweh Shah was teaching, and uh, he made a statement. When you read the book of Saint John, you know he made a statement about eating his flesh and drinking his blood. And you had people that would follow him, and they didn't get it. You know they thought he was talking about cannibalism. You know, they didn't understand he was speaking of in the spirit because his flesh is the word. Because the scriptures speak about how the word came down in the flesh as Yahweh Shai. All right? And they were talking about digesting this word. Like Elder Pastor Hart, he always makes the, uh, he always makes the statement about eating the whole roll. You know, I think one of his latest videos was I got to watch. You know, goes into pretty much eating the whole roll. You see? So, as Yahweh Shah made that statement and it went over their heads and they was being simple, a lot of people stopped following him. You know? Because it was a difficult saying. Well, how much more in these difficult times when following Yahweh Shah can cause your car to get repoed? But following Howard Shy can have you have to, you know, maybe move in with a brother. You might lose your privacy and, you know, a little privilege that you had when you stayed by yourself. You see? Well, what, what about when believing in Howard Shy? You know, you can't eat, <laughs> you know, uh, uh, as deliciously <laughs> as you once did. You know? So, a lot of people, as we know, People will be offended in what comes with following Yahweh Shah. And we pray we're not offended when things start to happen, man. When we start to take loss for Yahweh Shah, we pray that we're not offended, you know, because no one can say what they're going to do. We have a particular mindset now. We just pray to maintain it because we're all subjugated to the will of Yahweh Shah. Yahweh Shah. I just want to put this in, in your spirit. As we go through these things now, this is the mindset to go into this thing with. This is St. John 6 and um and, and 67. This is after well, I started 66. It says, From that time many of his disciples went back and walked no more with him. Then said Yahweh unto the twelve, Will will we also, alright? Will ye, all right, this is what Yahweh Shah said to the 12 after 
those people stop following. And it says, will ye also go away? You know, so you have a shot saying that the, <laughs> the masses leave, you know. So he turned and looked at the disciples and said, we, you know, we all go away too. And this is the mindset, all right, the response of Peter is the mindset to be in in these times. It says, then Simon Peter answered him, Lord, to whom shall we go? Thou hast the words of eternal life, and we believe and are sure that thou art the anointed, the son of the living power. You see? So Peter was like, what we, <laughs> come on, man. Where, where, where are we going to go? We forsaking everything. We, you know, we, we all out. And then we know for sure you the anointed. You know, he was fully persuaded. Peter was fully persuaded in his own mind. You know, we have to be fully persuaded as we suffer. Understanding why we're suffering. All right? And Peter had a mind frame that it will lead to eternal life, man. You know, and pretty much that translates to eternal rulership. All right? So as we get ready to go through this straight gate, this is the mind frame to have. Where will we go? You got to really think about it. What, what, where you going to go? What you going to do? Go, because, hey, you got it. it if you don't go through that straight gate, you got to go through the gate of Esau. You got to take, you know, <laughs> the juicy juice. Eventually, you're going to take the MOTB and and the missile's coming. Regardless of what you do, that's happening. Regardless of how you feel, what you think, your excuse for not, you know, riding this thing out. What you going to do? Go back and you know, plug into Esau's AI. You know, what what the hell are we going to do? Be an Amazon slave? For, <laughs> you know, what the hell is you going to, what are you going to plug, what the hell are we going to plug back into? This place done. It's finished. It's wicked as hell. All right. Where the hell are we going to go? And this is the mindset we should have. So Lord will, you know, this was edifying. You know, once again, we'll give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Kakwadash, double honor to the apostles and the elders of GM Bishop, rule well, teach well, being great example towards younger brothers, and peace and blessings, salutations, and hopefully, like Shalom.